Keep your calls coming in 03717 Let's speak now to Leicester fan. I've got The Brian here. Is that, is that The Brian? Oh, wow, OK. The Brian. Good evening, Brian. The Brian, sorry. Good evening. How are you, yes, The Brian? You all right, right, mate? Yeah, I'm not after watching that load of rubbish. Oh, what did you make I of mean, it? I mean, two people with friends of mine rang me up and said, are you watching? It's like watching paint dry. <laughs> OK, uh, so... And it is, because, I mean, don't forget, their player... Uh, their best player played for Notts County. He, he came on as a, on the sub all most of the season. Mm. Uh, they, I mean, they're just rubbish. But the most you think the football's boring. But so is um, um, the manager. We need some oomph. We need some fire. Okay. And he can't develop that. I applied for the job after uh, Allardyce was sacked. Now the hell I didn't get the job. I do not know, and I've still got the letter. All right, I'll tell you what, let, 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 let's try and be productive, because I, I, right. I don't want it to be okay. a show that comes on just we just bash Gareth Southgate after a 4 0 win, because I've heard those shows, and he's not going anywhere. Mm. So let's try and, even if you don't like him, and that, you're entitled to not like him, that's totally fine. Let's try and be a bit productive to get to a place where you can be appeased a little bit. What could he have done tonight? That would have that would have appeased you and would have given you something. Okay, I'm not a fan of his, but oh, fair enough, fair play. What could he have done tonight? Well, the first thing, why well, play Pickford in every game? Mm. Well, if he got injured, I mean, I don't rate him anyhow because no other big club has ever come in for him. But he could have given Ramsdale or one of the other goalkeepers a game today to be to be on the alert. If, that, if that's his number one goalkeeper in games like that, he could have played one of the others. Okay, so the, so he starts yeah, Ramsdale. The what, what else? Could, what else could he have done? Um, fullback Trippier. Well, he's, he's at the end. He's, he's he's done all right at Newcastle, but he's coming to the end of his international career, and uh, he's not going to go anywhere. And Madison was absolute rubbish. I know I'm talking his Leicester, but he was absolute garbage today. Nowhere near where like he can play. Okay, that's not that's not uh, Southgate's fault. No, no, exactly. But I mean, he picks them. Well, I yeah, mean, what did he, you make of the starting lineup then? Like, was, when you see Madison playing, uh, of course you want to keep him uh, at Leicester, yeah. but also the financial side of it that could be coming Leicester's way. What did you make when? What would you make of it when you see him in the starting lineup? Well, it's okay to play him. I mean, at least we've got a manager now. It looks like Pep, and he's Pep. I hope he plays the same football <laughs> that we've signed today, yeah. and hopefully he can and, and persuade Madison. He's still under contract, yeah. So keep him. Say to him, right. You cost us that relegation in the end with that diabolical penalty against Everton Gosh. and the goal he gave away against, I think it was, well, I can't remember, Bournemouth, I think it was, uh, diabolical. You know, uh, he cost us at the end. He obviously did well with the rest of his goals or whatever. But when it really counted, when we really needed him, he let us down. OK, so you, you've, you've quite wow. said that it, you were bored and, you, you you know, not impressed at all. I'm still trying to get to the point of what yeah. Southgate could do to appease you. you if, if Southgate hadn't have picked James Madison, I bet you would have called up tonight and said, why is he picking the same players? Why isn't he trying new things? Why isn't he giving him a Madison a go? He gives him a go, he was poor, and you're still killing Southgate. So I, I really no, need to because, understand yeah, what... But, yeah, oh. the, the first question is, what has ever uh, Southgate ever won? Nothing. But that doesn't help and us move forward. If he had the record, if Pep had his record or Klopp or anybody else, they'd have been sacked. Because he hasn't done po a thing. He hasn't won anything. Possibly, but again, let's try and be productive. What right, can he okay. do now? You can't compare him to Pep or Klopp. That's just, there's no point in doing that. So on what, Monday, on Monday, North Macedonia, Monday, what can he do? He's his strongest side. I mean, all right, Bellingham can't play, I presume. Um, but all the Manchester City players, because obviously they're the best side in the world, in my opinion, they've got the best manager in the world. God, can't we get him as manager of England? Oh. And don't forget, the England manager's job is not a full-time job. It's all hospitality for him. I've seen him at Leicester, and <laughs> I've been in hospitality. <laughs> all right, Brian. You know, it's just watching games. It's not a full-time job. I don't know how you didn't get the job, Brian, to be yeah, honest. Yeah, for real. I mean, I mean indeed, indeed, indeed. indeed, indeed. My letter. I think I, after... Mike Parry gave me stick when he read it, so I read it out to him. <laughs> Listen to Brian. Yeah. Cheers for your time, Pa. He's Brian's not Love impressed it, Brian. at all. Uh, thanks for calling up. I'm really keen to hear people call up and I don't mind you criticising Gareth Southgate, but I need more than just he didn't pick so-and-so, he picked so-and-so mm. because these are these are choices you have yeah. to make. Yeah, I, I need more than I that because on a 4 nil win... Yeah, that, that's what I mean. That's what I'm saying. I'm not, I'm not bashing Gareth Southgate. I'm not bashing the, the team because they've done a professional job. Mm -hmm. they, they they got it done 4-0. Um, like I said, it was a little bit boring. Uh, but what more do you expect against a team that's not giving anything yeah. anything back? So, yes, I actually agree with, with, with Brian against North Macedonia. Play a, a strong squad. Get it done. 
ha- half time, take a few players off. Make changes, but we'll we'll given our what do you think? Given our, our ideal uh, eleven, starting 11s uh, for the Euros next season uh, later in the show. So give me your, give me a call. And let me know what your if everybody's fit. Who is your starting eleven for the Euros uh, next season? Give me a call. Oh three seven one seven double two double three double four. The Sports Bar with Jamie O'Hara and Jason Cundy. Monday to Thursday nights from 10 on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.